We understand the details around the killing of uh, Ntlantlayenza are still very sketchy. Could you tell us what you do know? Uh, good evening, Anneli, and uh, good evening to your viewers. Yeah, it's, a, it's a grim moment for us. Um, I received the news about an hour ago. Uh, the details are quite sketchy, but it does appear, and it's alleged that three gunmen arrived at his home, uh, and when he exited the home, uh, they shot him uh, and then disappeared. Uh, it doesn't appear as though anyone else was injured, and I'm led to believe that the family are now in a secure place and the South African police services are on the scene and they've cordoned off, off the area. Obviously, you know, on behalf of the Democratic Alliance, I'd like to pass on my heartfelt condolences to the Ndlovo family and to our family, uh, the DA family uh, in Amgeni. It's a sad day. For those outside his circle of influence who don't have the privilege of having known him. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about him? What kind of a public servant was he? You know, he was, uh, I was thinking about it earlier, and he was, he was such an honest, open human being. Uh, I never heard a harsh word uh, from him. He was always accommodating, always wanting to please. As you know, he was, he was also the chief whip uh, in our caucus there. Um, and, you know, he's the last person uh, that should have to face this type of brutality uh, in front of his family.